Wow, a frustrating game all of a sudden becomes a very one-sided match in the last seven minutes. Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and Manchester United have beaten Luton Town 3-0 in the third round in the Carbill Cup. Now, in the first half, it was quite a slow start by Manchester United. Very sluggish, no passion, no drive. But then, towards the end of the first half, Luton Town laps in concentration, fouls Brandon Williams, and he's brought down, and one matter from the penalty spot blasts it into the net. So 1-0, just score half-time. And then the second half, again, slightly sluggish. And then, as the second half went on, Manchester United were growing in confidence in the match. And then we started to create a few opportunities. You know, Jesse Lingard had a few chances. Probably my man of the match tonight. Now, if this was Jesse Lingard's final game, I would like to wish him all the very best of luck. Even though the last two years he's been awful, I, if it is his final game, I still like to pay a respect to a player. So... If this is your final game, Jesse, all the best to you and good luck at your new club. But he definitely put on a good performance tonight. But if he does stay, who knows, maybe he's going to do Matic and turn his form around. If he does stay, then I'll be very happy he can do that, Jesse Lingard. So we brought on Bruno, Rashford and... and Greenwood, so, and then near the end of the match, the last seven minutes, we just absolutely dominated because Rashford scored, and then Mason Greenwood scored, so the substitutes work in their magic, and in the end, we got the job done, but in about the 81st minute, Dean Henderson, making his Manchester United debut, had nothing to do all game, and then all of a sudden stops Luton Town from scoring from a set piece. Pushed his hand out like that and stopped it going in the net. Fantastic save by Dean Henderson. So delighted for him. So hardly had anything to do, and his concentration was spot on. So well done to Dean Henderson. Great save. But 3 0, delighted to win the game 3. Right, so let's do the player ratings then. Dean Henderson, well, first of all, I probably would have only gave him a 6, but because that's that say 8. I mean, had nothing to do all game, but then did an absolute fantastic thing. So that's why he's getting an 8. Aaron Wambasaka, 6. Defended very well. Played pretty much the whole 90 minutes, I think. Harry Maguire, 6. A bit sluggish in the first half. Once he kicks the ball out of play, for no reason. So, I tweeted, I said, does Harry Maguire need to go to Spectators for kicking that ball out? It was shocking, but anyway, rest of the game, he did okay. So, 6. Eric Bailey, 6. Did really well. Brandon Williams, six. The left back, of course, winning us the penalty and also defended very well. Matic, six. Yep, he also played very well. Donny van der Beek, five. Didn't think he had the best of games, but he did everything he could out on the pitch. So. But it wasn't the first thing playing. It'd be interesting to see what he could do with the first thing. But yeah, yeah, it's a good game nevertheless. One matter seven. I thought he played very well, one matter. Looks very lively. Jesse Lingard. I gave a nine. My man of match. Because for the whole 90 minutes, he gave it. Absolutely everything. 
So fair play to Jesse Lingard. Man and match, as I said, could be his final game as well. And Igalo six didn't really have a lot to do, but was hardly got in the ball to be honest. But anyway, that's the match with you done. We win three 0 through to the fourth round. Looks like we're going to face Brighton next, who we're playing this weekend in the Premier League. So I'll do a preview for that on Thursday, because Friday I'll be doing an F1 preview from the Russian Grand Prix. Yep, so join me on Thursday for a preview to that game, the Brighton match. Yep, in the comments, let me know down below who your man of match is. Get in there, United. Tough game, but we got the job done. Bye-bye.